Hello everyone, welcome back to my YouTube channel. Today's topic is Backstage View of Microsoft Excel 2010. It was firstly introduced in Microsoft Office 2010 and it is very important topic in Microsoft Excel. It acts as the central location for managing the Excel sheets. Backstage View helps us to create the new sheets, saving the sheets, opening, printing, sharing the sheets and so on. In order to open the Backstage View, you have to click on the file tab click on file it will then start displaying the various option as you can see it is segregated into the three columns the information displayed in the second and the third column will depend on the option which we have selected in the first column as you can see in the first column we are having various options So we will be exploring these options one by one. There are various options available like save, save as, save as, Adobe PDF, open, close, info, recent, new, print, save and send, help, options, exit, etc. So the first option is save option. If a sheet is opened it would be saved otherwise a dialog box will be displayed asking the name of the sheet. So we will click on it, when we will click on it, it will start displaying a dialog box if the sheet is not previously saved, which will ask the name of the sheet, location of the sheet and the type of the sheet. After that we will click on the save, then it will be saved. The next option is the save as option. The save as, when we will click on the save as option, it will always display a dialog box which will ask the name, the type of the sheet and so on. By default it will be saved in the sheet 2010 having format.xlsx. The next option is the save as Adobe PDF. The save as Adobe PDF is used to save the already opened file in the PDF format. The next is the open option. Open is used to open the already saved Excel file. The next option is the close option. The close is used to close the already open file. The next is the info option. It is used to display the information regarding the already opened Excel sheet. Next option is the recent. It displays the recently opened files and the recently open places also the next uh, option is new new is used to create the new excel sheet or the new excel file when we will click on it it will display some more options like various templates of microsoft excel which we can select next is the print print is used to Print the already open Microsoft Excel sheet. Save and send. The save and send will save the sheet and it will display the various options to send the sheet by email, etc. The next option is the help. The help is used to get the help on any Excel topic. The next is options. Options is used to get the various options of Excel 2010. The next is the uh, exit. The exit is used to close the already open sheet and exit from the Microsoft Excel 2010. So this is all about the various options. Next, we will study in detail the info option of Microsoft Excel Backstage View. The info option in the first column, when we will select, it will start displaying the various options in the second column and the third column. As you can see, it is displaying the three options in the second column, permissions, prepare for sharing, version. And in the third column, it is displaying the properties of the files. permission is used to protect the excel sheet 
here we can set a password or we can log the sheet so that it would not be editable so in permission we can set the various permission related to the Microsoft Excel worksheet so next we will move on to the prepare for sharing this is prepare for sharing it displays the information that we should know before sending the file to the others such as who have developed the sheet means who is the author of the sheet if we are sending the sheet to anyone then we should also mention it versions version is used to display the various previous version of microsoft excel sheet if there are several versions then they would be displayed then we will be able to access the previous version of the sheet in the third column as you can see there are some more options like properties in the third column we are having various options like properties related dates related people etc it displays the information or we can say the properties related to the already opened excel sheet you can see there are various properties like size title tags categories etc sheet properties are displayed in the third column as you can see and it includes the sheet size the title tags categories etc we can also edit the various properties by clicking against them or clicking on the property value as you can see we can edit the title to xyz we can provide the tags we can also provide the categories if a particular field is editable then it will start displaying the text box if it is not editable then it will not show any text box so these are the various properties author it is showing the who is the author of the excel file so this is the backstage view of microsoft excel 2010 that's all about now how to exit from it in order to exit from microsoft excel 2010 backstage view we have to click on the file tab click on it after that we will be back on the sheet so that's all for microsoft excel 2010 backstage view thanks for watching the video if you like the video don't forget to like the video and subscribe the video in order to have access to the upcoming videos from our channel thanks again bye bye